Tuesday. I like Tuesdays. You don't like that Tuesdays though, do you, Jill? Last weekend's too far gone, the next weekend's too far ahead. <laughs> Are you taking the mic? Not a bit. <laughs> Look, say, do you know I like being your support worker and all, but why football? Couldn't you have chosen something like indoors, something a little warmer and a little less uh, muddy? But it's Tuesday. Tuesday is football with Eddie's. I like Tuesdays. Mm -hmm. Did you know it's full name's Edward Christopher Robson? I guess I'm bringing Edward, that would really annoy him. Uh-huh. <laughs> Eddie's birthday soon. Same birthday as Liverpool forward player Jerome St. Clair. Is that? Uh-huh. Same time is getting on a bit. Are you sure he's coming? Your sister said he didn't make it to football last week either. No, he didn't. I tried texting him, but I didn't get an answer. I thought maybe he'd gone down to Swindon to visit his nan. He goes there sometimes for a break. All right. Look, have you thought about giving him a call, maybe? Okay. No answer. It really is getting on now. Can we just go home? Sage? Sage, have you come back? God, I'm here to support you, not carry your bloody bag. before Sade finds out. Mm-hmm. You see, Eddie dies two weeks ago. Oh my goodness. How awful. I saw Alan his dad about a month ago and he said it wouldn't be long now. How awful. At least they got to see him before he died. Oh yeah, absolutely. Look, I, I don't know that Eddie knew he was ill enough that he was going to die, and I know that Sadie wasn't told he was ill either. God, Karen, she's going to be crushed. I thought I'd better turn her, but I just didn't know how she'd react, and I wouldn't be able to take any more time off work if she handled it badly to support her. That explains the no-show at football. Great, this is all I need. Look, Karen, I... You know, I, I get that it can be hard to know what to say in these kind of situations. It's, I brought this over, it's a bit of information on breathing, and these are the details for Eddie's funeral. It's next Wednesday, and I'm going to be there supporting Ellie and Jason anyway, so I can help out with Sade if you want. I don't think that's a good idea. I find funerals hard myself, it would be even worse for Sadie. I think talking about it might help. But you know what she can be like. It's all right for you guys to do the nice things. <laughs> guys, have you got any idea what we actually do? She Her is my sister. Can you call him? Who? Eddie. He's not answering his phone. You all right, Sadie? What are you doing here? You don't like Tuesdays. I like Tuesdays. Why are you here so early? Um, Say, there's, there's something that I wanted to talk to you about. That, um, Hang on a minute, Jill. Karen, what, what's going on? Eddie didn't go to football. He won't be able to play football anymore. Why not? Look, Say, Eddie, he's been ill and he didn't get any better. Well, he's gone to a better place now. To play football? Maybe. Look, I don't understand. Sage, 
Do you remember the rabbit? You know the one that kept dropping center, the really fluffy one. What? Bounce? Yeah. It's a Holland lock rabbit. Very affectionate breed. Yeah, yeah, no, I know. Um, look, Sade. <sighs> he might have been tickled behind his right ear. You said Bounce went to Bunny Heaven. Has Eddie gone to Bunny Heaven? No. Where's he gone then? Sadie, calm down. Don't start shouting. See, this is what I didn't want to happen. I am calm. Mom, Sadie, you, you really mustn't get upset. This thing comes to us all. What does? Calm down, Sadie. I am calm. What's going on? Eddie has died. How can I help you today, Sadie? You can't help me. Sadie's best friend has died and she's finding it hard to cope with the shock and the loss. I see. I'm so very sorry for your loss, Sadie. Why? You didn't know him. No, you're right. I do. Death can be a really difficult thing to understand and to process. It would take you a long time to feel like you again. Are you managing to eat the meals? What about drinking? Mm. It is really important that you try and finish at least one meal. Not eating it will make you feel quite weak. So? Sadie! Are you managing to sleep at all? Yeah. That's good. How many hours would you say? I don't know. And what about your anxiety? How are you managing that? I don't know. She was quite dizzy yesterday and said she felt sick. I didn't know it was a grief but only an anxiety. Sadie, the more questions you answer will help me to get a better picture on how you're coping. Grief can take at least a long period of time or a short period of time, depending on the person. But your family are worried about you. Especially with your anxiety. It's my job to find out if you need pointing towards the direction of agreement counselling. I can give you the details. What do you mean, counselling? 
Someone to talk to. Who will listen to you feel? All right. It might help you. Do you have, do you have any friends who can, who we can talk to? Friends who might be feeling the, feeling the same way as you, having lost a friend. You got Ellie and Jason, haven't you? Sadie, with your history. What do you mean, my history? You accusing me of being a nut? I'm not saying that. I'm merely suggesting that we can get you some help. I'm trying to avoid things getting even worse. I don't want your help. I want to talk to my friend Eddie. I don't want to talk to you or you or some counsellor. I just want to talk to Eddie. Can we go, please? Okay, okay. It is your choice to leave. But if we do leave, I can't help. I'm so sorry. I better go. Selfishness. You don't care about his family or how they feel right now. Sadie, we are here for you. We want to help you. Just, just leave me alone, okay? Just, just go away. What about tomorrow? We will be there for you. Just leave me alone. Just, just go away. Just piss off. Eight months. It's 
It's been eight months. I miss you, Eddie. Sadie, I'm off now. Back at tea time. Karen? Yes? What is it? It's just, I've been thinking. What is this? I'm going to be late. I've been thinking about Eddie dying and I stuff. I haven't got time for this. It's just, I've been thinking about how him dying's been making me feel, you know, all scared and sad and stuff. Sadie, why now? Why right this minute, after months and months of shutting me out, staying in the house all the bloody time, cutting off your friends, why now is this the time that you want to have a chat? I've just been thinking about it. Six months, so that's all you've been thinking about. Eight months? It's been eight months. Eight months, Sadie. I've told you time and time again, you need to move on. It's not healthy. I've got to go to work.